and welcome back to Port Royal. It's now an arts festival. There's an arts festival and it is a pleasant colony now with that festival here. So in that case here, um, why we are in the new world now, we have to focus on the caoutchouc and we have to focus well on coffee. Now for coffee, I've sent two cargo ships over here. There we have them, both of them with lots of materials. And let's get them to one of the islands that we can use for coffee and it is Santa Maria. Santa Maria, we do have still the ruins from Miss Hunt. In that case here, well, we don't care about that, but we care about the space here. Santa Maria do, does have the coffee fertility and it's got no rivers. So it's rather easy to build here without wasting too many resources and having lots of space for farms. In that case, let's get those ships over here. In La Fortuna, we do have the caoutchouc, but it seems like we're not producing enough caoutchouc for now. So we need to copy those fields here until we produce enough caoutchouc. It's very important for our bicycles. Bicycles are very important for my people. So, well, one thing leads to the other. We are going to leave those fields here open. Those oil pits here, oil springs. And here we can have another warehouse then. And here we can have another warehouse. Never forget, never forget a fire station. And here we can have another caoutchouc farm. And I guess might squeeze in one here. Just for that, let's upgrade the warehouse there. And oh, we don't have that many bricks. We should have to wait a second. Oh, they are quick though. That's something I really like about the cargo ships. They're really quick ships there. Did not expect them to be that far away. Um, in that case here, do we have enough storage? We should have enough storage. Cotton fabrics also not coming in that much. So we should have a look at that. Those guys here are not producing enough. Newspaper, let's have a look. We don't have much influence. Oh boy, this is not going well. Oh, this, look at that. Someone declared war on us a long time ago and he remembered kind of. We're not at war with anyone right now. This is a bit annoying and for some reasons we don't have any influence. It's incredible. But in that case here, perhaps we can squeeze something in. At least that it is positive, you know. At least that we, we don't have anything to do here. We can squeeze that in, right? Even though we don't need the bony that much, it's still very important to not get a plus 50% riot chance there. So that newspaper was a total mess when it comes to my sense of propaganda. And we don't have the influence for now. I'm looking forward to investors. So we should focus on getting investors up as quickly as possible. For now, we do have the cotton here. I do have a cotton shortage here in La Fortuna. And I'm so glad we have the commute pier in the new world. It makes things so much easier to not have to build cities here all the time. Let's get another one up here. We should be able to squeeze it in. That's fine, that's fine. So that's a bit more here because they do lack some cotton here for those guys here, so in La Fortuna. And we do now have more caoutchouc as well. So let's just have a look at that. We are not capped yet. We have three ships on the caoutchouc route. Hopefully that is enough for the caoutchouc that we need. That's fine. Now over here in Port Royal, we do have a quest. Like Let's have a look at that. We are lucky enough to be living times of peace, but many of my comrades are still fighting against the grip of La Corona. <laughs> they require weapons, but it would be too risky for you to smuggle them yourself. If you entrust me with the supplies, I could send them to my comrades through our underground network. You didn't what? You want weapons? 14 tons of weapons. I don't know if I want to give weapons to my people, but anyway, let's, let's turn it in. She's looking nice at me, so that should be fine. Sivington little epidemic there. So what's the reward? You're faster than the old Honolero. Steel molds, trade union, brick factories, productivity 35%. Oh, well, that's a good one. We can use this. Never have enough bricks there anyway. All right, we do have the ruins here. Let's get rid of all the ruins that we have on Santa Maria. We do need to clean it up. So those are all ruins here from, you name it. And thus we have boosted the 
attractiveness again. And she's got lots of ornaments here. Look at that. Right, so that's that. Over here too. There we still have something. There we have some farms. Nothing too serious. And some roads there. Let's clean it up. And just in time, my cargo ships arrive. Now, let's turn in the resources that we have here. Lots of them, I think, yeah, even steel beams are here now too. Um, first thing that we need to do, as always, is having a commute pier. There it is. Oh, yeah, that's influence again. So we do need to get a bit more influence for that. Still fighting La Corona. Yeah. I hope these weapons help. They might help. Let's have a look at my investors. Light bulbs are coming in now too. Um, the thing with the fur coats right now is that we don't have... Oh, we do have the problem with the cotton. Hopefully we solve that now in the new world. And that case here, glass, what I can see is a problem right now. So we should fix that too. We do have quite a few problems right now in our logistics. Let's just check how much sand we have. I actually do have enough sand there for my glass makers. And yes, we can increase the productivity here by 40%. That should be fine. We do need more glass here. Right, so that's that. So let's have a look at our resources. Spear is still out. The rest is looking rather good. Sewing machines is going up again. Um, fur coats because of the cotton is down right now. We do have lots of chocolate. That is interesting. So we do have the item up there with the bakeries that occasionally produce chocolate. This is quite a lot of chocolate that's coming in there. And the glasses is looking too fine. The light bulbs though are a problem. So they're still not really rising. We do have the filament factory up here. A bit minus happiness for the engineers is fine for now. We're still positive and we do need to produce more filaments there. Let's have a look at my coal. Coal is looking fine. Wood is still looking rather low. So that's that. So hopefully we can get some glass in here now for those light bulb factories there. That's a very important one. And then, well, we still have the problem with the influence. So we do need to upgrade more buildings. That's absolutely necessary. Now that we have enough workers again, what I also want to do, I want to um, ramp up my steel beam production again. Right, so we do need to produce, produce more of that again. So with that, of course, we do need more workers. Let's upgrade some here. There we have a ruin. Here we can still upgrade. We still have enough farmers. Another block over here. And probably something here. Oh, that's going to be too much. No, oh, it's actually fine. Right. That's fine. We still have enough bookers. A few more upgrades there. A train is passing through. In this beautiful town of Crown Falls. A dreary capital at the moment. Let's have a look at our attractiveness there. Vulgarity. Slaughterhouse, soap factory, rendering works. And pollution, the furnace and the steelworks are the major problems here. So that is something we can fix though. And I really just want to wait until we have the palace, right? And the palace should fix those things then. Let's also upgrade our oil harbor here. Right, so it looks like my production is going up again a bit. So what we can do here... Since those things are going up, well, we can hopefully upgrade some artisans soon. I don't want to upgrade any more workers, perhaps this block here, you know, so that we should be able to afford. And for that, we go, we upgrade a few more farmers. That's it. And we can still squeeze in more farmers, well, over here somewhere. So in that one here, that's fine. And we do need the workforce of those guys here. Unfortunately, those farmers are not giving us enough influence. That is a pity. But in that case, let's just keep it like that. And can we upgrade now some artisans? Yes, we can. So let's upgrade artisans. We need more engineers. Those guys here. Right. Very good. So we have lots of um, engineers then now around the center here. 
perhaps we do need some here that we can upgrade a few more artisans then and this one here that's fine oh we still have steel beams more invest or more engineers that is and those guys here and that block here very good having more of them unfortunately it doesn't really influence our influence there influence yeah from the population so we really do need those investors before we can continue in any meaningful way and well coffee is the goal for that otherwise we cannot do anything oh miss hunt go away from that what i can do though is i could get rid of those smaller islands here you know i could give it to, to miss hunt i wouldn't care to get a bit of influence back we have way too many influence let's have a look at my influence tab so here we can see it and what costs us the most military and expansion now expansion costs us almost 600 influence and the most of it is from islands we have so many islands especially the small ones i know it's not a good practice of giving those small ones to miss hunt for example but they're not really any use to her as well so let's get rid of quietus <laughs> okay that's really a marginal income of influence there in that case the other thing that we still need to do is the rum production right now we don't have enough rum in crown falls now let's just check here real quick how much rum we have and we are pretty cap much capped here even though we just got a ship here getting 200 goods there so we do need more ships on that route here it seems we have over 600 rum in kingston and we do have enough ships for that so let's get the rum Kingston, Crown Falls. We already have quite a few ships here, but let's just get Explorer and Merlin on board there too. Remember, rum is really a, a well, it's a resource to get really easily and is consumed by a lot of people. Also, very important for our tax income. We do have a nice tax income right now, but of course, everything below 100k is not good enough. So in that case here, let me just check how much sugarcane we have. We are full on that too, so we can have more distilleries. Those guys here, they do need some wood there too. I think we have enough, yep. So let's just get a few more distilleries up there. And we have... We do have a fire station down here, but one is not enough. Oh, where's that? That's sifting once again. Do we have the resources? We Oh, we do have a hospital there. And we can mobilize, so we should do that. Or it never ends. Right, and we will need another warehouse then over here. Uh, let's upgrade them as well. Just like so, for a bit more run, but we got so many ships on that now. Hopefully that is, that is doing something, you know, hopefully we got enough there. And we do have quite the defense here. Let me just, I know it's really bad, but let me just get rid of two of them to get a bit more influence um, back home again. And we do have a massive defense in Port Royal. So let me get rid of the big cannons here in the back. We still have big defense here with the ships. And now we have 35 influence. That's pretty good because now we can finally, finally have, let me just do something here. Now, Explorer was one of the ships with our building resources. That is not good. We can finally have the commute here in Santa Maria and finally build our coffee production. Now, let's start here once again with the commute pier. That costs us so much influence, but now we do have the workforce that we need. So we don't need to worry about a city. And the other very important thing that we need to do is having some depots. Right, and we still have another cargo ship coming up there with some bricks that we need. But we don't actually need that many bricks because coffee is purely timber and some bricks, I think. Right, so going down here. 
and there we can have the first warehouses now for our coffee production let me just have a sh quick look at it again there we have it coffee plantation some farmers and some timber this one here does need a bit of brick stove but not much in that case that should be fine 84 fields it is so we can build them like that and let's build them as close over here as possible just like that and then we can squeeze a few of them here into Santa Maria the people celebrate your leadership and here's the end then they take one minute this one takes 30 seconds so for each two of them we have a coffee roaster and this one we can move over here of course what we also will need here is another fire station also the plantations also tend to catch fire from time to time This one here lacks a few fields over here. That's fine. Let's get over there. Of course, this is not enough. We have nine so far. I think I think 20 might be fine. Well, we are at 19. Let's just skip 20 altogether and go even higher than this. Game save. Right, so, so there we got now 24. That means we can have 12 coffee roasters that is still fine and while well, that's only this spot here so we still got lots of space especially over here so this is the bigger side and here we have some space too and the coffee roasters well we can have here in santa maria let's just have a little path there actually santa maria might be only there for coffee but we can still make it a bit beautiful right some palm trees belong in the caribbean in the new world there the over here left buildings abandoned Stiffington, we shouldn't forget about that First then i want to have count. warehouse here yes yes deteriorated as always and once again another fire station in the meantime where is my cargo ship if only people... where's my cargo ship there it is. Santa Maria. Oh, it's here. I totally did not see it. Now it can be on the rum trade route. Off you go. And here we're now going to have 12 coffee roasters. Quite big buildings there. Uh, Miss Hunt. She placed parks here everywhere. Surprised at that. Look at that. And another warehouse then over here and one over here. That's fine. And here, as always, let's have some palm trees there again. Looking fine. It's actually not looking so bad, right? Oh, well, it does. But still, it's good for the coffee there anyway. Now we do have the coffee production. Hopefully that is enough. We can upgrade a few of those warehouses here. That's fine. And here, let's have the trade routes. So we do now have a new trade route that we can create with that. We do have Santa Maria. And we go for Crown Falls over here. And we take all the coffee that we can find. So in this case here, we do have cargo ships on that trade route. So we can have up to six slots full with coffee if we want to. And I think we're going to. And let's have a look. Condor? Nope. Pepper, pepper pot. Pepper pot is in Cape Trelawney. Fine. Um, in the new world, we have Condor 2 on the trade right now because Condor 2 is here at Santa Maria already. And African Queen, I think they're in Cape Trelawney again. 
Yep, they're African Queen. We can take this one. So three ships now. Let me just go to the Cape Trelawney there real quick and have a look at this one here. Yeah, there's nothing on board. Very good. So now we do have the coffee, the last resource that we needed for the engineers. And in that case here, the only thing that's missing now is, well, electricity. And for that reason, we already have, as we can see, a railway here that's going to the harbor in the center of the town. What I can see here too, which is not looking pretty, is those dirt farms, uh, dirt streets there. So let's just beautify this here with, well, some trees there. Going all the way up here. Those trees take some time here to load. All right, and down here we want to have now a power station of some sort. So let's have a look. There we have electricity. How much oil do we have? I think oil will be the next problem. It's stable for now, but it's not going to be stable forever. So in that case, we could have, we should have it here. There we have one and we should have a second one too. Over here we're going to have lots of engineers up here, up over here. We already have a power station there, so we have some engineers with electricity already. But in that case, this is an important one. And then we just might have it over here, perhaps instead of the church. Over here makes sense. Having it here and having it done here is better. So in this case here, we do have the pub and the marketplace here. Two buildings that we no longer really directly need in the center. So we can move them over here. Both of them. Right. And then we move those investors over here. That should work. Whoops. Of course, it has to look somehow appropriate, but the game adjusts itself to that. Beautiful. And then we can have them at the corner. Right. And then we can have another power station here. Then now we just have to have a look where we want to have the railway. We do have the, the street there. So let's have this one here. After all, we do need the power for that. So let's have that. And then we have another one here. The thing is now, of course, we're going to lose lots of oil with that. So oil will be another thing that we need to reinforce. And there we have then the power station going in here. Here we connect it in a very strange intersection that we have here. So let's make this a bit better. This is looking better. And then we need some crossings here again. So this one, this one. Um, here we'll need another one, here we have another one, and here we have two. And here, well, we might just have some trees or something like that hiding our station. Not everybody needs to see it, so we can almost, almost not see it anymore. And there we have a, a tiny little place here in the center. So, well, let's just have an apple tree here. Right, that tiny apple tree there in the center. Lots of free space here still, so that is where we have the trees then. We can squeeze in here beautifully. There is another one over there. That's working out, and we still have some farm roads here too. Stuff that we certainly don't need in that area.
and especially not around the palace then. But the palace is not here yet, so that's fine. Very good, so that's that. Now we have electricity here too, and hopefully that's the last thing then, and we can soon upgrade to investors, because we certainly, certainly do need our influence there. That's important. 